Hello everyone, I hope you all are doing well. In today's video, we will be discussing about how to calculate the percentage decrease using two methods. One is the formula method and the other one is the multiply method. So let's start. Let's suppose we have an item. The original price of that item is 15 dollars and the sale price is 9 dollars. First of all we will be using the formula method. In the formula method we will be use, using a formula that is amount of change divided by the original price multiply by 100. The amount of change is the new price that is the sale price minus the original price divided by the original price. into 100. We are multiplying it with 100 because we have to find out the percentage. Now the sale price is $9 and the original price is $15. So 9 minus 15 and it will be divided by 15 because it's the original price. Multiply by 100. 9 minus 15 is minus 6 divided by 15 into 100. Remember, minus sign always show a decrease or a loss. Okay, so minus 6 divided by 15 is minus 0 0.4 into 100 and that will be 40% decrease. So this is how we can calculate the percentage decrease by using the formula method. Now let's calculate the percentage decrease by using the other method that is called the multiplier method. We will be taking the same example over here. The original price of the item is $15 and the sale price is $9. Now what is a multiplier? Multiplier is how many times the original value has decreased. Right. So first of all, we have to find the multiplier. To find out the value of the multiplier, we have to write new price, that is the sale price, divided by the original price. So now the sale price is $9. The original price is $15. Right. 9 divided by 15 is 0 0.6. This is the value of the multiplier. So now to find out the percentage decrease, I will write down 1 minus multiplier. We subtract 1 because we have to find out how much the value has decreased relative to the original amount. So 1 and we have to multiply it with 100 because it's a percentage. So 1 minus 0 0.6 into 100. 1 minus 0 0.6 is 0 0.4 into 100. That is 40 percent decrease. So this is how you can calculate the percentage decrease using the multiply method. I hope you like this video. Please subscribe to my channel. Thank you.